People ask us a lot about how to record and even live stream their DJ sets. In other words, using video as well as audio. So we've talked to you about camera angles, we've talked to you about overhead angles, we've talked to you about recording the audio from your devices so that it sounds awesome. But one thing we haven't talked to you about is voice. How to get your voice into the mix because you might want to do a show, you might want to do a podcast with music. So for lots of reasons, having a good microphone and a good setup is a good idea. Now a lot of people, if they're live on video, use a lapel microphone or a lav mic, which is what I'm using here. This has got a box to have in my pocket. It's a radio box going over to our production team over there. But if you're doing it on your own, then a podcasting mic might be a good solution. And I have just that kind of mic here. This is a Blue Yeti microphone. It's a very famous microphone for this kind of thing among podcasters for good reason. It's extremely, extremely professional and it does the job brilliantly. But when you combine it with an arm, this is the Compass Arm, they call it the Compass Arm, and this, which is called the Radius 3 shock mount, then you get something which is great on your DJ setup like this. So I can switch over from this to that and as you can hear it sounds absolutely awesome you can get these things that go in front of it they're called like pop shields which are just which are there so that the p's and the s's don't make the microphone sound a little bit unnatural uh, but i haven't got one on here the best way of not doing that is just to not put the microphone right in front of your face so i'm talking at you but the mic is slightly off to one side you this kind of microphone you want it six inches to a foot from your face but now i can dj and i can chat to my audience i can take my comments over on facebook or whatever and it's all going to be uh, very professional very good sounding so the shop mount is there to stop stuff you do here vibrating through and going into the microphone which is a rookie mistake so that's really nice the arm itself has got adjust so that you can make the tension right so that the microphone's weight doesn't pull it down or up and it just stays where you want to put it. As you can see, it moves like this and it's got a mount on the desk which lets it be tightened up securely onto your table. You can also get a drill that goes through. So let's talk a little bit about the microphone itself, although this is kind of a review of the whole thing. Let's talk about the mic. So it has a mute button on the front so you can turn it on or off when you need it, especially if you're broadcasting live uh, and you don't want to, uh, to, to be over at your computer adjusting the mic volumes, although of course you're gonna have to hold the mic to do it. Let's just mute it. And there we are, back on again. Uh, there is a volume control for the headphones there. You can monitor what's going on in the microphone, not something you're likely to want to do if you're DJing live, of course. But the interesting thing on this microphone is around the back. So around the back here, we have the choice of how you can set it up. So you'll hear my voice is altering as I move around. That's because this is set to uh, cardioid, which allows this area to get all the love and everything at the back and around the outside, not so much, which means it cuts out a lot of background noise, which is a traditional problem with condenser microphones, which is the kind of microphone this is. So that's a great setting. It's the one you're likely to use. Uh, and also around the back here is the gain control, which is just the output volume from this to your system. It's a USB cable. It's nicely hidden through this arm, but there is a USB cable, a USB cable going off there. So it plugs directly into your Mac or PC, no drivers or anything required. It will just show as an audio input that you can record from there. So this kind of microphone is going to be useful for you in situations like if you want to record your uh, yourself at your desk podcasting, if you want to record yourself at your DJ desk as I'm doing here, you'll see a lot of people who do Facebook live DJ shows using something like this. My friend Jay Cunning, who has a, a show every Tuesday, shout out to you Jay, uh, uses a similar setup with an arm uh, so that he can uh, take Facebook comments and so on while he's DJing live. And that's the, the thing that I think DJs are going to find this kind of mic most useful for. This is the blue microphone uh, kit. You get the arm, you get the shock mount and you get the microphone. Uh, and it's $199. So if this has been useful to you, please subscribe to the video, to the channel. Uh, please like, please share, please follow, do all that good stuff, and I'll see you again very soon.